Well, I'm here with Frank from Simrise. Now, Simrise is an unusual company in your ethos and your makeup and your thinking behind everything you do. Yeah, on top of all, with its people, I mean, we, we at Simrise really feel that we have a very special crowd of people at Simrise. And it often gets reflected back from our customers that we are special to work with in a positive way. Now, when you're talking about the people you work with, is that talking about the people that, that produce the, the food, the, the crop that you then purchase? Our farmers, uh, which we uh, tend to have uh, very close relationships to, which we want to know, be it in Madagascar for the vanilla, be it in Holzminden for the onion, be it in Antran for the beetroot, we know them, we are with them, we are, they form part of our extended family and community, certainly. We think that that is important, that they have a good life in order to produce good quality, that they are part of their communities, that we are part of their communities. So that's very integral part of our backward integrated philosophy. So we hear stories, don't we, of, of farmers, the people that do all the work, that they don't get much in return. We hear this all the time, don't we, globally. So this is something that you as a company try to work against. Yeah, what, uh, what, uh, what we work, uh, work for is uh, everyone needs to have a decent living. Yeah? When we talk about the European farmers, uh, that they um, have more large-scale farming operations sometimes, our chairman always says, we want them to be happy. Not too happy, though, because the value needs to be passed on to the consumers eventually. Of course, and, and then once you've got people working for you and they're on your side and they're all pulling in the same direction, they then go that extra mile to deliver you something even better. Absolutely. I mean, it's really an integral part of our quality philosophy and our strategy that everyone has their valid part uh, and uh, a win-win position in, in that uh, value chain. Now, for anybody out there that doesn't know Simrise, what you do, Tell us a little bit of a detail, go into a little bit more. <laughs> <laughs> you mean the company or myself? The company to start. The company, well the company is a taste, uh, taste company really. Of course we have two big parts in the company, we are, we are fragrance company and we are taste company. And in terms of taste, in terms of nutrition, I mean, we've diversified. Uh, we've had Diana as a big milestone coming into Simrise three years ago. And that really defined how we evolved from the classical flavor house to, to really a broad taste supplier with uh, bits and pieces here and there that are catering for the needs of our customers. So all what you see here in the stand over there, clean labeling, uh, naturalness uh, under the motto best of science, uh, best of nature, best for you is really an integral part of our uh, genetic makeup. And then going back to the people that you work with, it's very important that they also buy into that idea of best of nature, best of science, best for you. They also have to buy into it to get the best out of them and you get, get the best out of you as well. I mean, our people are very proud and passionate about all that. Since uh, what we do is happening around where our locations are, uh, really the fields uh, of onion are outside Holzmin, the fields of uh, uh, like the vegetables are outside Ren, where the headquarter of Diana is, the same with the US, same with Singapore, same with our locations. Our people really know and feel what the business is like and uh, everyone at Simrise is really proud to be part of Simrise. And again, that gets reflected back from our customers who like to work for us for this p particular passion that we bring to bear every day in our work. So how do you go about selecting the people that you work with? Because it must be quite a, quite a tough selection process. Be prepared to come back five, six, seven times to the people that you work with. I mean, it might see from an applicant point of view a very slow kind of process, but in the end you know if the company is right for you and you are right for the company. That is taken very, very seriously by all of us in management to pick and select the right people and uh, to be sure that we have the right fit. And so going into management, what is your role within the, the entire organization? Yes, my role is uh, Vice President of Culinary. So I'm uh, responsible with my team uh, to give the right uh, savory taste to products like soup, uh, instant meals, uh, instant noodles and processed meat. So you really have to understand what it is that the final goal is that you're looking for? Yes, absolutely. <laughs> I mean, like, uh, we deal with some of the most uh, intense challenges in food, yeah? You see, like, uh, big uh, people are going away from industrially processed uh, convenience food, which is a big industrial business nowadays, and uh, so it's stagnant. We grow at a double-digit rate in our area, 
I'm really, really proud of that. And that shows that with our strategy, I think we give value to our customers, with, which they can pass on to consumers. Which is fantastic news as a consumer. <laughs> now, finally, what does it mean or what's it like for a company like you to come to FI Europe? How important is it? It's very important because everyone is here. I mean, it's uh, very, very important to exchange. Me, myself and the team, we had uh, countless customer interactions uh, today. You get a very immediate feedback on strategy because we show our key competences here. And uh, it's, it's, a, it's a great life exchange with customers who reflect what their customers want, the consumers. Absolutely. Well, thank you very much, Frank. Uh, if you haven't been yet to the Simrise stand, come and speak to the people. Come and check it all out. There's a lot to see and a lot to do as well.